Big change from yesterday where we had those funnels across the area. Amy in Covington sending this great weather photo to us at See It, Shoot It, Send It on DaytonsNewsSource.com. Another great photo by St. Paris off to the north there. A lot of great photos there on the website, and the National Weather Service really relies on a lot of people on the ground, and that's storm spotters to actually give them the information. As a matter of fact, we have a few storm spotters right here in the Miami Valley. I took an exclusive look with them. When severe weather strikes, your first warning weather team is your dependable source for severe weather coverage. So, trained storm spotters have spotted a tornado, so a very serious situation. Recently, a group of Ball State Meteorology graduates started a local storm chasing team. So, as you can tell, we are in a hail floor. We started SWAT, which stands for Severe Weather Alert Team. SWAT was tracking the tornadic storm Saturday in western Ohio. We were in Piqua, in Miami County yesterday. Um, saw some funnel clouds and some wall clouds. So. Knowing the lay of the land is very important when storm chasing, and for these guys, it's their backyards too. We're all from eastern Indiana, western Ohio, so um, just having a chase team in this area is pretty unique. Unique and very valuable to the National Weather Service to help issue warnings. So just helping the National Weather Service get real time and get warnings out and get good storm reports from the field is definitely one of the biggest goals. These hailstones are huge and this guy is still low on the lawn. The SWAT team has a decked out vehicle to help them inside the storm. We do have the weather station on top of the vehicle which transmits live data right here into the middle of our dash. Once the team intercepts a storm, each person has a very important role. The most important seat in the swerve is definitely the passenger seat here, the front passenger seat, where we run a wide array of radar and forecasting products, as well as a live stream that streams out the front of the vehicle that you can see on our website. The team has picked up several sponsors recently, and one of the most important has been Spirit Medical Transport. They supply the team with valuable medical supplies and training in case the team needs to help victims if a tornado touches down. So when a tornado warning is issued, seek shelter immediately and leave the storm chasing up to the professionals. As exciting as it might be, um, when those tornado warnings get issued, there's a reason they get issued, and people need to heed those warnings and seek shelter. Reporting for Dayton's News Source, I'm Andrew Michael.